Hey guys, welcome in today. Got a new project for you guys that might seem kind of simple, but it is almost impossible because it's called the Impossible Triangle. So the Impossible Triangle was popularized by famous artist MC Escher, and it was actually invented by Roger, Roger Penrose, somebody that um, we, we studied a little bit in my class. I show him a really cool documentary um, from Roger Penrose that talks about MC Escher and his influence on art. I'll put that link in the description just because it is an awesome, awesome documentary and I like documentaries um, because they tell about how the, how we kind of get started on art it's always good to know about kind of the behind the scenes scenes of famous artists and their creations so we kind of can understand the art a little bit better so besides that the impossible triangle is like I said it's a simple idea but it's very very complex in how to do it so I'm gonna start off very lightly with my pencil and then I'll probably do that a little bit fast and then I'll go in with marker but there's a couple tips and tricks after I get it done that I will show you that will help you guys with. build it so it's Paul. just an idea that there is straight sides to this triangle that it doesn't have pointed sides like a normal triangle. After I get kind of those three sides that are kind of straight, kind of about the same, I'm not gonna use a ruler right away, but I will eventually use a ruler to kind of perfect this. That's why I got it sitting out there. So really lightly, just making sure, as I always do lightly first, and then I can always go back and fill it in a little bit darker once I kind of got an idea for how it goes. So the outside shape is similar to a triangle, except it has kind of flat, sides on it after i feel pretty confident in that i can kind of darken it up a little bit but i'm going to keep it in pencil before i fill the whole thing in in marker and an important thing for this impossible triangle is that each side has three lines so we already have one of those so we need two more lines for each of them and how i start this is i go from the top from that upper right corner to about the middle eh, probably a little bit further almost about three quarters of the way down so that would be my second line. This corner, so from this corner, so you wanna leave a little bit of gap in between there. So from this corner, same thing, about three quarters. Again, I'm doing it very, very lightly, just, just to kind of introduce it. So we got one, two, so now we need the third one. And that's where it gets a little bit tricky. So you gotta kind of connect some of those lines. So we go from this little corner, I'm gonna start on this left side. So this corner will then go in to this one, but this one also has another one that kind of goes into the next one, which goes into the next one. So you can see how it kind of almost cycles into itself. An important trick and an important tip to this one is to try to keep all these about the same size. If they kind of get off, you can kind of erase and kind of fix them a little bit. But if they're not the same size, it'll kind of throw it off a little bit. And I think I got it pretty good. So I feel pretty confident about my middle shape is about right in the middle. So that middle triangle actually will have a point to it. So that middle triangle will have your triangle in it. So then on each side you have one, two, three stripes. So that would be my third, one, two, three on this side, and then one, two, three on this side. And from there, now that I feel pretty confident in it, now I can go over to marker. So I'll do that nice and quick. there it is the impossible triangle it is possible actually and I added a little bit of shading just to make it look a little bit more realistic kind of in the corners in there to where it would kind of impossibly bend into itself um, so thanks again for watching this video if you like it make sure to hit the thumbs up hit that like button down below that's how I know which videos you are liking the best so I can do more of those hit the subscribe button as always subscriptions are the easiest way to find all my fun videos coming out multiple times a week for you and throw a comment down below on your main Maybe impossible your favorite impossible shape of the many that there are and as always thank you for viewing guys I am mr. Shooty this is mr. Shooty's art class and we will see you later